So I am really happy to be here at uh, at uh, the Bio Bangalore Tech Summit. Uh, I think it's a very unique tech summit, of course, because we have brought up information technology and biotechnology and the whole sort of convergence here. Uh, this particular session uh, that we had was really uh, focused a little bit, I would say, uh, on healthcare and uh, and in particular about uh, the rare disease uh, uh, policy that uh, the state of Karnataka uh, has uh, now under is, in, is considering uh, taking forward. The draft uh, for this policy uh, was put together by a division group uh, for biotechnology and appointed drafting committee and several of the members of the drafting committee were in the panels and made presentations today and uh, we also heard about the national policy so it does seem that uh, uh, the whole topic of rare diseases uh, how biotechnology can innovate uh, in and, and at the same time help these uh, patients with rare diseases and uh, and how the government can can play an enabling role uh, all of this was discussed in some detail and uh, and I think you know the session obviously went uh, more than half an hour over time uh, and the, the audience didn't move uh, uh, you know I think there was a lot of emotional uh, you know in, uh, uh, sort of involvement and engagement with the, with the topics discussed and uh, I do believe that uh, uh, we are ready in this state uh, to actually uh, do something uh, very progressive uh, for these patients who have really been children of a lesser God. They've really just fallen in the cracks between uh, you know, public health and, and sort of private health care. And, uh, you know, and I think it, this topic, uh, it really uh, deserves the kind of attention it got today. It was a very engaging panel.